Hello! Today I'm making the most delicious hoisin sriracha sheet pan chicken. And these are the ingredients that you'll need. Let's preheat the oven to 400 degrees and let's get started. To begin, we'll make the most amazing marinade starting with one third cup of hoisin sauce, one third cup reduced sodium soy sauce, two tablespoons of maple syrup, two tablespoons of sriracha sauce, one tablespoon of rice vinegar, two teaspoons of sesame oil, and two minced garlic cloves. And lastly, a half a teaspoon of minced fresh ginger root. I'll whisk it together really well. Next, I'll peel my sweet potato and cut it into 3 fourths inch bite sized cubes.
I've prepared my sheet pan with tin foil and lightly sprayed it with oil. And now I'm putting my four chicken thighs down the center. I'll now put the sweet potatoes on each side of the chicken. I'll drizzle a tablespoon of olive oil over all of it. Now I take that delicious marinade and drizzle a third of it all over the chicken and the veggies. I stir the veggies around and the chicken to make sure it's all coated well with this delicious marinade. Into the oven it goes for 15 minutes. While the chicken and sweet potatoes cook, I'll chop my red pepper into bite-sized pieces. I'll get my fresh parsley chopped. I forgot to put the fourth teaspoon of salt and the fourth teaspoon of pepper on the chicken before I put it in the first time, but I'll get it on there. After turning my chicken and salting and peppering it on both sides, it's time to add the other veggies. The original recipe calls for fresh cauliflower. I've had good luck just using a bag of frozen cauliflower. Now I'll add all the peppers. Time to add a third more of that delicious sauce over everything. And then you save the last third for the end. Add the last tablespoon of olive oil over all of it. Back in the oven it goes for 30 more minutes. Now that it's done, I generously sprinkle all of it with sesame seeds. The last of the sauce. And some parsley. It's time.
time to dish it up. You have to make this recipe. It is so good and we've had it so many times in our home. It's definitely one of our all time favorite sheet pan dinners. Please like and subscribe for more goodness.